This your boy CJ Goodfella with Colossal Boxing, aka Boxing's Don Corleone. Gennady Golovkin is the subject of the topic today. A uh, real deal, a real hype. Um, I mean, I'm gonna break it down. It's kind of a two-part answer. Uh, his resume averages out to a C plus, B minus at the most, in my opinion. Um, hasn't fought the top opposition. Um, pulling up boxing rec right now, and you let me know uh what what you averages out to, and let's see, he fought. Adama, C fighter. Curtis Steven, C plus fighter. Matthew Macklin, B fighter. Uh, Ishiata, B, C plus fighter, B minus fighter, however you want to do it. Gabriel Rosado, solid C fighter, C plus fighter. Prosca, uh, I think he moved up too fast, but he had ability. But I give him a C. He's a C plus fighter. And those are the most notable ones. Kasim Oma, a good C, B, solid fighter, if you want to say that. Um... And then that's really the names, the names on on the on the boxing rec list right there, and and his ability is a ability, no doubt about it. People that bash Gennady Golovkin don't know boxing, because I give you an example. Curtis Stevenson is not the best fighter, but he had power. He did all that talking to make Gennady Golovkin fight a firefight with him, fight fire with fire, just turn into a savage brawl. But Golovkin. Remain disciplined, which is one of the most underrated boxing uh, attributes, is discipline. It's being disciplined inside and outside the ring. But I'm touching on inside, to being, to being able to be disciplined and to use his jab, use distance. He's the taller, had the taller man, the taller reach. And I would box Curtis Stevenson. And then when he had Stevenson hurt after the left hook and he noticed he was hurting Stevenson, and Stevenson was starting to slow down, he closed the distance and closed the show. So he showed boxing ability, outside ability, some inside ability, and he showed the ability, which is one of the most spectacular things of boxing, is I'll box a dude and knock him out. Finish, close the show. And a lot of great boxers can't close, wasn't the best closers, but Golovkin is definitely has A ability, but a C plus, B minus resume. Uh, uh, some of his weaknesses include not moving ahead very well, um, which, which is okay because he controls distance well. He's an excellent boxer. Um, uh, he bends his knees. Basically, he's just his, his being, and, and being robotic. He's kind of robotic. He's not smooth, um, fluent with his punches, but he can have fluidity in his punches when he throws combinations when he settles down. Sometimes he takes a little time to get in rhythm with those combinations. Uh, similar to a couple other fighters, but Golovkin's always seems to settle in, feel what you got, and he feels more comfortable throwing combinations. Golovkin, real deal, real hype. Um, I'll let you be the judge of that. The haters will say, oh, he hasn't fought anybody. Yes, he hasn't fought anybody, but dudes are ducking him. Do I think he will search your Martinez ass? Yes. Do I think he puts Peter Quillen ass in the dirt? Yes. Do I think he beat Chavez Jr.? Yes. Do I think he beat Andre Ward? Hold up. Wait a minute. If he fight Ward, and War having fought coming off a layoff, I give Golovkin a real chance because Ward will be rusty. It, but I would still favor Andre Ward to probably unanimous decision that ball. Um, who else is up there? And then you had rumors of him uh, hitting Sergey Kovalev to the body and running him out of Abel Sanchez's gym. Um, Golovkin, the, he's real trained by Abel Sanchez. I mean, he's a big puncher. He's been around forever. Just came over to the states to get his name popular. Um, would have fought. Was supposed to fight Chavez Jr., but uh, you know, top rank tried to lowball Chavez Jr. because he didn't want to sign an extension. Um, sound like he's gonna fight uh, Daniel Gill. Let's get it on. I like Gill. He can show angles. He can. He's a little, little irky jerky to me. Got a little nice, little smooth style. But I expect you know Golovkin to get the job done. In my opinion, Golovkin is the real deal. Um, has to fight starting fighting real opposition though. But uh, he's a real deal. And this is Colossal Boxes uh, talk. Uh, coming across your screen please subscribe like the video and share do whatever you're gonna do um thanks for showing us all the love you have showed us uh support the o's hitting the like button hitting the subscribe button and uh from my comrades Jarrell jasper michael turner miguel mighty mouse we all appreciate the love and uh 
Good luck in the real deal. Let me know what you think about it. Uh, go like Colossal like, so Box and Talk on Facebook. Uh, and I appreciate all the love. And uh, sleep supporting the Colossal so Boxing brand. And we will. We do good fantasy fights. And uh, go look at those on our page. And you can make a request for the next two or three weeks. And we'll write it on up as soon as possible. This is Colossal so Boxing Talk. Salute you. We gone. Oh, <laughs>